Well, hello and welcome to this tips and tricks video for PC Building Simulator 2. I have just put out onto the shelf right over here a computer I called the Llama Box. I just put a llama sticker on it and did some spray painting on the side. I find it kind of funny that it sold like almost immediately after I put it out there. I don't know what the algorithm is in charge of that, but that's just kind of interesting. Now you can see here on this quest for the RGB cable that it's green. So I'm going to show you how I did it. It's going to be pretty simple. All we're going to do is come in here and we're going to remove all of these cables. Now I cannot take credit for the tip that I'm about to share because I found it Googling, took me over to Reddit and uh, somebody had posted about doing this and I followed those instructions and it worked. But it's got to go to that Reddit poster. I don't know if I'll link to the thread for that or not down below. So the next thing to do is to remove the power supply. Now in the post, the Reddit poster said to remove and replace it with a modular power supply. It's already a modular power supply. Maybe an older version of the game was using a non-modular power supply, but in this case it is a modular power supply, so we don't need to worry about that. We just put it right back in. It says owned by. We know we got the right one. Now go over here to your cable before you do that and make sure you select the cable that you have made so this one here i'll show you how to make it in a minute we've got this uh, rgb different styles here i'm going to do the uh, flat ribbon braided why not and then we'll install our power supply and that's what i did to help this go through i don't know if that was necessary those steps i'm just letting you know the steps that i took to make the cable all it is come in here to custom cables and you would think that this would be opposite this side but it's not as you can see uh, i learned through the course of making this little tips and tricks video that in reality you have to follow the exact pattern all the way across so the, the email says red green blue cables only that's your hint that's your instructions you do red green blue in any pattern you want only there's no other special requests, so you don't have to put any stickers on or spray paint or any of that stuff. So no issues there, but this is the exact set that you see that I'm going to be putting in here in a minute. I'm not going to order this set because I've already ordered it, but now you guys know exactly what I used and exactly how I did it. And you'll be able to get the checkbox too. Okay, so we've got the power supply in. We've got our cord selected on the cable. Now we're going to start putting this in. Do not forget to grab the one here in the back. That's the hard drive would be funny if the set failed that he liked the other the mirrored set better don't forget the one here on top that's for your power button i do wish i had more computer management cable options i mean in this but now let's see if our little tap yep there it goes check good as you can see if we zoom in because we did uh the set on the same repeating the same pattern we now have red on the underside as well as on the top side let's grab these cables put them in place boot it up up. we're not going to do that we're just going to boot it up and call it good so i'm going to turn on the power go over here press and hold f2 been doing that with all the computers on this i go to the ram overclock and turn it on starts at 266 so 2933 seems pretty good to me once it boots we're good but in real life you want to run through a bunch of tests to make sure everything's good before you hand it back to your customer all right it boots we're good so shut it down All right, we got the little blink. It tells me we've done it. It says everything's good. Grab the computer. We'll run as fast as we can with this big, giant, bulky computer in our hands. Come in here and check. Okay, we can now correct our payment. Open up our thing and check our payment. We're going to find out that we have a five-star review. Here it is. Claim it. Five-star review. No subquests, so we don't have to worry about anything checked down there, so we're good. And that is how you beat the Red Green Blue Cable Quest in PC Building Simulator 2. If you would like any other tutorials like this or any other quests for your spec, let me know in the comments below the video. I want to thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you think of this game. I'm kind of curious. I'm enjoying it, but I noticed when I tried to stream it, nobody seemed really interested in watching it, so hey, I get it, but curious. See what kind of responses this gets. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Mm -hmm.